Hi, my name is Roy Smith and I'm the author of the Campfire Gang series. Uh, this, this is the kind of uh, book that the parents can relate to, that they can encourage the heroic, God-given part of their, of their child. Uh, one of the compliments of uh, one of the, the, the fathers who was discussing the book with the son that meant a lot to me was he said that this is like John Eldridge's Wild at Heart, but it's for little boys. And it teaches them a sense of adventure. It allows them to take that God-given aggression and guide it in a certain area whereby they refuse to be domesticated, but they go out and they find adventures. We have a world filled with problems. We need cultural heroes who are willing to go out and make a difference in this world. And these young boys need to be able to express those aspects of themselves. Uh, I think it's important for young men to have a group of, 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 of friends they can rely upon. You know, if Jesus Christ is God, and we believe Jesus Christ was God, and Jesus Christ had 12 disciples, shouldn't we have at least six male friends that we can hang out with that will push us towards excellence? And uh, I believe that the Campfire Gang, as you watch them interact with each other, create the kind of model that I'm hoping young men will learn is an important part of their life. My favorite character is Pops. He's an old man that shows up. Um, it's hard not to talk about Pops without feeling it because Pops is God. And I want these kids to have a sense of God's presence with them, a sense of familiarity with God, and a sense of relying upon God. We're getting a lot of young men that are understanding the message in it of spirituality and relationship with God uh, and the importance of character building in their own life while at the same time having great a great time drawing the pictures of some of the weird creatures that they run into and and uh, interacting with uh, what life may throw at these kids next.